It is grilling season year round here at Pits and Grills because if you have a big green egg, you can use it year round. Nick, I am so excited, A, <laughs> to try a pizza and to drink my Bloody Mary. Thank you. Awesome. Yeah. Thank He's you, already sir. been sipping. I have He's been. He's feeling real good. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Nick, great. what are we making? So we're going to make pizza on the big green egg today. Okay. Um, just we like showing off the versatility of the egg and how you can do anything, you know, you can do in your oven or in the smoker or on the grill. You can do all that stuff on the big green egg. What are I some of the that, benefits yeah. of using the big green egg? Is it just easier? And yeah. is there a good flavor? Yeah, so the fact that it is the ceramic hold on to the temperature um, super, super well. It's really efficient. You can get your temp up to five or 600 degrees in 10 degree weather and it'll stay there. You know, we first did this recipe um, back in, was it February that we had that super? Yes. Oh, yeah. 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 We were out here cooking pizzas out in front okay. of the Okay. Well, we're talking about mm -hmm. we're talking about winter time, which when I think of grilling, mostly I just think of summertime. So mm -hmm. you're telling us all year long we can do this. Absolutely. Yeah. That's one of the beauties of the big green egg. If you can cook it on the grill in the oven, um, in a pizza oven, you can do it on a big green egg. You can do it any time of year. I'm curious yeah. to know then about sizes. Are there different sizes of the big green egg? Yeah. Is there one size? Do you need more than one? Yeah, there are seven different sizes of the big green egg. So if you want to, um, you know, take one. There's a little mini max for tailgating, or you can put it on your boat, or you can, um, you know, get all the way up to the two XL if you're cooking, you know, for commercial applications. So I love that. Yeah, the extra large is the one that we recommend. Mostly, uh, you can you know do your meat, vegetables, potatoes, all on the same you know same grill all at the same time. So and we're doing pizza today, which is not another thing I typically think about when you're grilling. Now, Nick, do you have do you have uh, recipes and things that people can look at for good ideas like this? Or I know you do some cooking classes. Do you mm -hmm. show people? I know that you're happy to. Yeah, help that's out. that's that's why you buy it from us, right? Because yeah. we teach you how to do all that stuff. We we're not just selling you a grill like you can buy at the hardware store. We're going right. to teach you, you know, how to use it and how to get the most out of it. This so is what, looking good. This is looking amazing. What are you putting on this pizza, by the way? So we put down our sauce and some basil. Um, first, we start off with the dough from the pitch. I don't know if I mentioned that, but we oh, like wow. to just go down to the pitch on East Sunshine, uh -huh. pick up their pizza dough, then you don't have to worry about making it and doing like it all that. yourself. And this, this makes it so easy for the kids and you can just roll it out and throw it on the grill and, and they're fantastic. Now, how long will this bake out on the grill? I this, say bake. How long sure. will it grill? Yeah, so we're going to put it on there at 425 degrees for about uh, 10 minutes, and mm -hmm. then we're going to brush a little butter around the crust, Ooh. put some seasoning on the crust, on the edge of it, and then put it back on for about another five now, minutes. Now, you just yeah, said something like that. that triggered my uh, brain looking around the store, yeah. too. You get the green egg, but you have amazing seasonings and accessories and everything you would need to use the big green egg or another grill. Absolutely, yeah, we've got, uh, we've got everything you need for grilling, smoking. Um, we've even got sausage making equipment now and high temp cheese for the deer hunters and you know we've got all kinds of if you can you know cook outside with it we've mm -hmm. probably got it. This is a whole sport Jeremy first of all <laughs> I, I, mean, I was looking around all the different flavorings uh, I feel like I need one of every kind. I do too. Because there's so many different combinations well you've got something I'm already getting uh, yeah. of that. I'm gonna buy this right. seasoning because I love it yeah. I, I love Bloody Mary's have yeah. them usually every weekend at brunch yep. this is one of the best ones and you put something special on this one too it was the uh, we've got Cosmos brisket mop in that one so it's got a little Worcestershire <laughs> sauce and uh, you know maybe a little A1 flavor to it, some celery, you know that things that good. it's really good. go good in a. That in a sounds bloody great. Mary. It's really good. So the reason you left this crust a little bit open there is because that's why you're going to butter it and put the seasoning. Absolutely, on. we're okay. going to season that later. But I we're going to put some goat oh, cheese. Oh my here. gosh! Look at that. A little mozzarella too. Can I already say I feel at home here at Pits and Girls <laughs> because I feel like if you came here and you have a question like I do. Yeah. Nick is happy to help. There's no dumb questions. You ask what you need, he's going to help you. And everybody here has been so helpful really, when we're are. asking yeah. little things. Oh, what's that? What's that? Exactly. I love all the accessories. I do too. So many great things. And he's a pro here. He knows what he's doing. Look at this. Yeah, we want we want people to go home and get the most out of their equipment. You know, if you yeah. like I said, if you buy it from us, we want you to know how to go home and make the best ribs in your neighborhood and try tip and just really. Uh, go over the top of so it. So no question is a dumb question. No, that's, right. that's a good thing. For example, no I mean, we're making pizza on the Big Green Egg. Is yeah. there anything you can't make? Like, could you yeah. make desserts and... Absolutely, yeah. We bake on the Big Green Egg all the time. I did uh, a peach cobbler in our last class. Mm. Yeah, with fresh peaches. And, yeah, this smells absolutely. amazing. 
All right, should we put, yeah. is this ready for the grill? This is ready to go on. Okay, your hands are dirty. You want me to grab it? Absolutely. Okay, I Thank got you. it. Just pop it in. I'm just going to stay here and drink this. I know you We're back with this amazing pizza. It did not take long, Nick. Not, not a, yeah, 12, 15 minutes. Cut it, Kelly. I'm okay, hungry. I'm talking about it. Cut it. <laughs> it looks hang so on. good. Oh, oh hang on hold to it. the pizza. Well, that's a sign of a good crust. Yes, it is. Okay. I want it crispy. Okay, this. Oh, wow. Oh, I'm going to split this other side for you and Nick. This is okay. my piece. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll cut a smaller piece. So as we're cutting this, Nick, uh, if somebody wants to come by and get the perfect grill, ask a lot of great questions that you'll answer and get the accessories where are you located? How can people get in touch with you? Yeah, 1920 East Sunshine, uh, wow. pitsandgrills.com. You can give us a call, 417-501-8737. Um, we're here oh. seven days a week. <laughs> you Please. take the big one. That's okay. Wow. You take the big one, Nick. Okay. Mm. <laughs> I mean, who doesn't want pizza and margaritas? No, I'm sorry, uh, Bloody Mary. <laughs> Have you yeah. been drinking? <laughs> <laughs> Nick, thank you so much. Thank you. You're welcome. This is amazing. Get to pits and grills today. Mm. I want some pizza right now. That was to die for. That pizza was way better than my egg pizza yesterday. <laughs> yes, it was. Way. Somebody was asking me about your egg pizza yesterday. I don't know if you're watching today, but uh, the first one had to go in the trash. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You but know what? That happens sometimes. It happens. It happens sometimes. I said it was hungry. It was pretty good. Yeah, and head to Pits and Grills for lots of grills and seasonings. So good. You'll make a really good pizza. Lots more fun coming up on Ozark's Fox AM right after this. Yeah, it was really good pizza. That's good. I couldn't believe how crisp and Crispy buttery. Crispy it was. So yes. Oh.